How's it going guys? Um, Jack Pugsley here and welcome to the channel guys. Today, um, more transfer news coming out of the city ground. Um, but before we get into it, I just quickly want to say, um, the business that my club, your club, Nottingham Forest, are doing so far this season has been absolutely phenomenal. It's been mental. It's been absolutely mental. Uh, so yeah, this video is me announcing another sign-in made by the Reds. So yeah, stay tuned. Okay. Um, let's sit down and uh, announce another signing and uh, this one is a, is a very very special one uh, for me personally as well Wow, hey guys um, Nottingham Forest have confirmed the signing um, of an extremely highly rated a lot of potential um, type player um, ex Paris Saint-Germain ex PSG defender uh, before he signed for us um, Nottingham Forest have confirmed the signing um, of Loic Mabe So um, and this transfer window if I'm totally honest is probably the best bit of business Forest have done in absolute years uh, the fee is around £5 million on a three year deal I believe as well uh, 5 million euros something like that I'm not too sure what that, what that translates to um, in, in the pound ok so I've just googled it um, and we've saved 500k um, so we've got him for 4.5 million quid million pounds uh, yeah, again, this is an amazing signing. The reason why this is is quite special to me is because so is a player that I've actually signed on career mode for Forest as well. I think I got him to around an 88 rating, 89 rating. Um, he's six foot two, 19. Um, so much potential, and for 4.5 million pounds, it's an absolute bargain in my opinion. This is the best business that we've probably done all summer. Um, delighted with it. Um, it just shows the, the trust that Moranikis is putting in Sabri this season. Last season, I don't think there was much trust in Sabri, and I mean, I mean, I don't blame it. Obviously, he's, he's a manager that's never really proved it anywhere else, and he did have a decent season last year. Obviously, we did bottle it towards the end, but he's had a decent season, um, and it just shows the trust that Moranikis is putting in Sabri this year, which is really, really good to see. Um, and Sabri can't have any excuses this season. We've got to perform. We've got to go up this year. Uh, so yeah, just delighted with this. Really, am delighted. So. Um, has represented France at every level um, except the, the official one alongside on Titi or Pavard. One day he'll make it, I'm sure of it. Uh, born in Cameroon, decided to represent France. Um, six foot two centre, but like I said, made 20 appearances for PSGB um, and three appearances for the actual PSG official team. Um, and yeah, look, it just shows his potential uh, to play alongside Neymar and Mbappe. Um, and I am very surprised that PSG have actually let him go for so cheap as well. Um, I've known this guy's name for a while and I'm so surprised I've let him go for so cheap. He is one of one of PSG's own. Um, they obviously Mbappe came through the Monaco ranks, I believe. Um, so I don't think they've actually ever brought through that many players. Um, I could be completely wrong there, uh, but off the top of my head, I don't think they have. Um, and so is one of the players I've actually brought through their academy. Um, and the fact they're selling them for f for five million euros. Um, I would have thought but the potential he has they would be wanting at least 40 million do you know what I mean for a big club to come and swoop him uh, but for the, the level we're getting him at the price we're getting him at it's just yeah it's astonishing business by Forrest um, and this is off season I'm sure of it but yeah guys like I said um, drop your opinions in the comments your thoughts on the signing uh, me personally like you know delighted with every single business we've done this summer so far it's all been superb I can't I'm not disappointed with one signing that's what it's come to. I'm not disappointed with any of the signings. Delighted with every single one of them. Uh, so yeah, just really am excited for the season. And the live streams, live match day streams uh, for every single game. Uh, live watch longs like I did last season for a couple of games. We'll be back, so make sure you tune in for them. Uh, so yeah, look out for that. And also, um, I bumped into a very familiar face uh, yesterday. I didn't expect it. Finished college, walking, walking through the town centre. I bumped into this man. Um, yeah, did not expect it. Uh, but yeah, like I said, obviously, seeing Kashi was a bit of a shock. Um, I wish him good luck. I said congrats on the move. Um, I think his girlfriend's from Nottingham, isn't she? Uh, so yeah, bumped into Kashi, which was very unexpected. <laughs> but yeah, guys, um, if you have enjoyed this video, please drop a like. It's really appreciated. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already and turn post notifications on. And uh, yeah, Loic Mbe So. I'm pretty sure that's how you pronounce his name. Um, I'm awful with names like these. Uh, but yeah. So, it's a Nottingham Forest player and the Reds are going up. Thanks for watching guys, and I'll see you very soon. Forest till I die.